hello, this is Shankar and uh, I'm going to talk about uh, Sagittarius. Uh, how's the year 2017 for the year for the Sagittarians? November 23 to December 21, that's the time frame for Sagittarians. And uh, it is uh, symbolized by uh, an archer. Uh, the planet ruling is Jupiter and it's a fiery sign. Now, what is the characteristics of art uh, uh, of Sagittarius in general? They're very independent people. They are honest, they are patient, they're enthusiastic, they're philosophical, they are argumentative, uh, they are, uh, and uh, they are very impulsive in nature. This is what basically Sagittarians are. Now, the positive characteristics which work in their, in their favor is that they are uh, fearless people. I repeat that that is the key word: fearless. They are frank. They want to start something new. They are independent. Uh, they are generous in nature and they are very curious about things. So these are important positive traits. The negative traits are they could become very bo boastful, I would say boastful. They could become aggressive. They are confident. Uh, confidence, overconfidence is bad. It could become an exaggeration of your um, uh, confidence and uh, they are tactless and inconsistent. So these are the negative traits of Sagittarius. Now let us see the Sagittarius born during the uh, three parts, uh, 23 11 to 23 November to 2nd uh, December. Uh, such people have got the uh, rays of Jupiter around them, which makes them lucky, makes them frank, makes them generous, makes them um, compassionate. They are, they, the only negative thing is they, are, they have a very dreamy picture of a domestic, uh, domestic place and uh, you know a very dreamy picture of romance which never gets uh, fulfilled otherwise uh, there are people who with their honesty, generosity, confidence uh, and uh, traits uh, like this uh, are uh, positive and uh, create knowledge and wealth for themselves from 3rd December to uh, 11th December is uh, by the planet uh, the energy of Mars is there so when Mars is there it gives them a tremendous amount of energy so their uh, their uh, uh, their whole idea of uh, being uh, fearless being impulsive uh, being uh, uh, being uh, ra uh, being uh, being that you know the determination to do things uh, get gets the flip of uh, mars which is uh, very positive gives them a, a lot of uh, energy uh, only and the best part of it is uh, you can call them anything but uh, they could be aggressive independent but at this point sagittarians uh, generally do not uh, become negative in uh, their approach uh, they do not become deceptive they do not become cunning so it's a positive uh, impact the only problem with the sagittarians here is they can call a spade a shovel i mean you call a spade a spade but here they can call a spade a shovel so that is the problem which is uh, there otherwise uh, energy in the sagittarians is good and then from uh, 2nd of december to uh, for 12th of december sorry to 21st of december uh, the, the planet uh, the energy of uh, sun is there which makes them a very different kind of person makes them very intuitive uh, such are the people who become prophets seers mahatmas people who are respected privileged people uh, those people who you touch foot they understand philosophy they get intuition they, get, they understand things which is beyond uh, beyond our understanding the horizon and they also become a very good counselor so uh, that way Sagittarians uh, this part of uh, the decant uh, that is from uh, 12th of December 21st December uh, people can become uh, philosophers and uh, people who are uh, knowledgeable uh, the best part of it is as far as uh, marriage is concerned uh, since they have uh, this whole idea of uh, uh, being uh, sincere, being sensible, uh, being uh, serene, uh, they try to hold the marriage. Uh, only thing is uh, they have to take care of the uh, boastful uh, nature and uh, and uh, the, 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 the and and the kind of uh, sometimes the kind of inconsistency which they get into. But by and far, large, Sagittarians are good material for marriage and love. So let us come straight now how the year 2017 would be for Sagittarius. Let us see the issues where um, there will be an expansion, activities in areas which would be uh, which would be in the field of expansion and uh, Jupiter, 
uh, that, that is the and the planet Jupiter plays an important role. So that is what I consider. So uh, in the in in this phase uh, between January to June, July, uh, you would see Sagittarians uh, working on the profession, working on prestige, doing things which are which are different, doing things for the people generally in society. Uh, making a name for themselves around people, uh, taking care of elderly uh, people. So it's professional prestige which is important and thus they give a lot of importance to their home, uh, people in the domestic environment, people in the office as well as at home. Uh, um, uh, dealing with the wisdom on matters of uh, uh, property, uh, renovation, etc. That is done with a lot of wisdom. They also, th therefore, also focus on matters of uh, service and intelligently uh, take care of uh, their uh, competitive, uh, con intelligently take care of the competitive environment. Uh, also, uh, take care of um, other matters which are related to uh, uh, which are related to uh, money uh, borrowings. Uh, enemies and um, so on and so forth so this is the period on january to june july it is profession prestige coupled with family finance uh, uh, domestic peace harmony house and uh, service matters and also dealing with issues like uh, debts and your you know health they will become health conscious also this is the focus from january to july and from july onwards the focus then becomes gains what do I, what do I get out of it i've been working very hard for my profits i've been working very hard for enhancing profession or doing my prestige now i should uh, get profit out of it so from july to december august to december uh, the whole focus would be on you know ensuring that they get the profits they get what they desired what the aims are they get fulfilled um, also a good time for love relationships and uh, marriage uh, love and relationships basically um, also they would uh, those who are in the business of uh, public relations communicating on behalf of other people that is communicating for communicators um, uh, they do very well also it's also a good time for those who, in, uh, who are interested in the counsel counseling business who are in the consulting business and who are also consultants to business as well as politicians as well as in the service so it's like an expansion for those people and they try to ensure that you know they they they, they not only get recognition for which they work but also get uh, profit out of it that's uh, that's the most important thing they also in expand their relatives, friends, people around them uh, get uh, close to the uh, uh, siblings, uh, the sisters, the co aunts uh, so on and so forth and uh, uh, take initiative. This is the time when between July to December there would be new initiatives which would come in the, in the forefront which would also enhance your business partnership. Um, uh, you will be effectively dealing with your opponents it is also a good time for those in uh, those uh, in relationships also those who have got married they will feel good about it they will feel nice about it uh, it would be uh, it would be your uh, tendency to ensure that uh, uh, your relationships both at the personal level as well as the professional level that is your spouse or your girlfriend or with whom you are having a you're about to marry uh, they feel good and in the same way it's also for business partners uh, you would uh, try to ensure that they see the uh, the profit uh, in your in your moves uh, i mean they all get um, they all get an uh, understanding whether it's tangible or intangible in terms that you know something is being done by yourself so well, this is what is there from july to december so these are the areas of focus uh, for jupiter in july to december is of, more towards increasing your uh, increasing your um, base of friends, uh, booking profit, uh, enhancing profit, ensuring that you get a dividend for all that you've done, and also that is coupled, of course, with family, finance, um, uh, your uh, business relationships, uh, speculative money, and uh, on the personal front, I explained you with us marriage relationships and. Uh, contacts. So this is how it uh, it, it goes um, after July, basically August to December. That would be a focus. Now let us see the areas where you need to be careful, and that is between April to August. Between April to August, uh, uh, Sagittarians need to be careful with respect to issues with respect to expenses, investments. Uh, they could increase. This is the negative part of it, uh, which would happen. Expenses would increase. Investments may not go in the right direction. 
the money which you have uh, start any anything which is uh, any strategy which has to be done on the back end i mean you're strategizing something which is not evident you're speaking something but everybody has a strategy at the band at the back that may not uh, that may not get fulfilled your international relationships there could be problem uh, dealing with the people uh, who are abroad or foreigners with whom you are dealing if any that could be problems you could uh, end up uh, paying bills for the hospitalization for your family or for yourself <coughs> brokerage uh, those in brokerage trade or in the trade of um, allied trade uh, there could be issues in matters of service in, uh, in matters of service in matters of competition in matters of litigations uh, to repeat uh, you could uh, you could uh, see yourself facing uh, greater expenses and greater efforts in dealing with uh, litigation matters or you would be opening uh, opening uh, opening areas uh, where there could be uh, potential uh, li- potential litigation you would also see that you know your this during this time fortune or luck will not be uh, basically uh, helping you so that is one thing which which could be frustrating so it's 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 more of a negative part in terms of expenses in terms of hospitalization you're feeling isolated dealing with foreign countries um, uh, your relationship with people abroad issues with family finance and service family finance and service they could uh, you could end up uh, on a negative uh, balance sheet uh, the, uh, Uh, there could be a potential of some litigation starting and fortune will not be on your side today really april to august if these things can't be careful do not try to you know push them or do not try to fight with them just let the time pass and uh, things will become better that is my advice also certain other periods which uh, which you need to be careful is from uh, march to mid april uh, uh, be careful with issues with uh, uh, with domestic peace domestic happiness mainly issues with <coughs> property Uh, property property matters your happiness quotient will be <coughs> will be getting challenged that will be at the lowest ebb um relationship with the people around you in at home will not be very good uh, there will be a certain negativity in the uh, in their professional environment uh, which is there wherever you are working so basically that you should take care during this time but uh, mainly uh, take care of your property um, and um, allied issues if uh, they are there from uh, mid april to mid may and that's from march to mid april from mid april to mid may please be very careful in speculation uh, uh, matters of share matters of trading if you are in the trade of uh, pr if you are in the trade of cinema art uh, please be careful in matters of love and relationships uh, there could be problems and uh, negativity could arise there please be uh, careful during time but in terms of financial matters be careful with paper speculation and uh, with the strategy or the policies you made uh, that, that's uh, that's uh, that's critical between mid april to mid may then from mid august uh, to mid september uh, please uh, be careful with uh, uh, with your uh, with your luck with your job you know you'll be lucky in your job but this time will be a time when you know you will feel that you know things are not good you will get a feeling of leaving your job but don't do that 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 may not uh, that may not be very good but you will have this frustration in your job in your profession those who are in service in business also there will be a kind of frustration uh, there will be a feeling that you know that luck is not favoring you things are not happening in the right direction so mid august to mid september is is a period which uh, denotes uh, denotes this uh, my general uh, thing for sagittarians is uh, yes uh, you 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 uh, you are uh, going to be you are going to uh, do well initially in your professional uh, uh, pursuits and also the gain from professional pursuits that is going to be net net positive but Uh, do not uh, try to push your luck and fortune uh, the lady luck or the fortune which you've been seeing too much i mean do not count on it be very careful if you try to do things which are out of the box in terms of uh, in terms of uh, in terms of uh, taking advantage that luck is in favor let me you know do something which is different which is uh, which is uh, which is uh, which is not as per the rules you may land yourself into problems so that is one area where i would uh, like you to 
be careful or to put in a different way do not the sense of right and wrong what is right and what is wrong uh, should always remain there if that gets uh, swayed or blurred that is you feel okay i've done a lot of right things let me not try this method which could be on the debit which could be you know tending towards wrong you may put yourself into problems so the sense of right and wrong uh, should be kept always and uh, if that you try to change or try to play and go beyond a point uh, you could land yourself into uh, into into issues which will not be favorable so this is it uh, for you sagittarians and uh, uh, thanks uh, thank you and you can uh, get in touch with me at connectingminds at gmail.com happy new year thanks bye bye